Durham is one of the oldest and most prestigious universities in the UK, so you'd expect it to have some pretty fancy academic dress to match. Durham is split into smaller colleges, and at some of these colleges, students wear gowns throughout their university years. This would usually only be for formal occasions, such as dinners, but it's still pretty unusual. Most universities now only require students to wear gowns at graduation. The Durham College gown is being modelled here by myself, and it is plain black as you can see, and can be identified by this small split in the sleeve here. Just try not to dangle the sleeves in your food at a formal dinner. Now, when it comes to graduation at Durham, things get a bit more exciting. Bachelor's students have their own style of gown, which can be identified by its unusual sleeve. There is a slip that runs vertically to the elbow and then is held in place with a button. There is also a cord and button at the back of the neck. These gowns are pretty unique to the Northeast and Durham and Newcastle and are the only major universities that use this style of gown. The bachelor hoods at Durham tend to differ depending on the faculty you graduated from. So, for example, art students wear different hoods to science students. What unites them is that most of the Durham bachelor's hoods feature a white fur edge. This is the BSc hood, which you can see follows a colour scheme of purple and red with white fur, and these are common colours seen on many Durham hoods. This specific purple colour is known as palatinate purple and is uniquely associated with County Durham, which was historically called County Palatine. The other common hood you will see is the Bachelors of Arts hood. Again, it has the white fur trim showing for a bachelor. The Durham hood is also a unique shape, with a long back and rounded corners. Now, master students at Durham wear gowns with long closed sleeves, which also have the cord and button on the back of the neck. The Durham Masters hoods come in all different shapes and colours. They do, however, follow the colour scheme of black, purple, red and white. This is one of the most common Masters hoods that you will see, the MA, which you can see more in a triangular shape. The MSC hood here that I'm wearing is the same shape as the Bachelors hoods, with the rounded corners, but it doesn't have any fur. Now, if you're graduating from Durham, you may be disappointed to hear that they don't actually officially use hats as part of their academic dress, so you wouldn't need to wear a square cap or bonnet to attend your ceremony. However, here at Churchill Gowns, we do include a cap with our Durham sets, so that you can wear one for photos, or maybe just throw it in the air if you want to. The Durham doctoral students also follow the colour scheme of red and palatinate purple, but their robes are much fancier. As of course you would hope for, with all the hard work that goes into doing a PhD, the students are awarded with this red gown and hood, with palatinate purple trims. This makes you really stand out at graduation. 